Oh yeah, baby. Disgust. Let me just climb up here. It's a dike in my backyard. So we're gonna hit that and then jump it into there. I'll stand on this side. Here we come. Oh yeah, baby. Oh yeah, baby. Woohoo, that was some hang time. It's about a 10 foot, uh, probably can't tell on the camera, but it's about 10 feet. Chop a nut. Just starting to rain too, it's sunny all day. Big backflip. Got a new GoPro, so hopefully I'm getting it all on, uh, all in frame. We're gonna hit this, and then we got some more jumps coming up. Pretty nice landing too. It's like bark mulch. And then I got my little road here. I've kind of made over the days. Good old M2C chassis hanging in strong. I'll go in detail after the uh, after the video. So that's a Traxxas sledge, as you can see with backflip tires, M2C chassis. I'll go over the truck after the video, all in detail, what I'm geared, everything to make it as durable as it is. Cause this thing's a tank right now, super tank. Oh yeah. This is probably my all-time favorite, most durable RC I, I've got. Whoa, almost hit me. Oh no, no! Oh, okay, hike we go. Be right back. Yeah, she did a flipper. Yeah, I can't even get full throttle with this thing. She's a ripper. Boulder. We'll do this jump a couple more times and we'll go over to the, uh, the big mounds. Oh, that's a floater. Nice. It's a little hairy coming into it. As you see, there's a big bump there. It's, uh, I can't really get a good run up. I, I want to come in here with a rake and smoothen it out and just. I want to hit this thing and I want to clear this whole pit. It's probably a good 200 feet. Probably couldn't clear it, but I want to make it at least past that or like in that puddle somewhere. Anyways. Oh, throttle. Yeah, baby. <laughs> I got to turn down my brakes a bit. Man, this this thing is tough. I like this is this is my favorite RC and the uh, and the uh, the Arma Fire Team. 
probably my two favorite RCs. If you gave me one to choose from, I probably couldn't choose. I would have to get both. I had to do more mods to that. Actually, I'd probably get the fire team. Well, I don't know. I was jumping this thing pretty big, and I was kind of... Yeah, I don't know. Oh. And she's unplugged. Huh. Well, guys, I'm gonna have to cut this run short. I, uh, I broke two battery straps. I broke the long one. Oh, that sucks. Oh my god, I ripped the antenna out. This is carnage. I'm just gonna plop this back in here quickly. Oh, that's terrible. That's never happened. I thought it just came unplugged. Broke a battery lead off that. Yeah, that's a pretty big jump. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna have to cut this short. If this video is too short, I'm gonna just have some footage of the Arma Fire Team. But I'm gonna go fix this. Yeah, I broke the long battery strap. It snapped right out of there. And I broke one coming across here. It just snapped right there. Maybe because it's cold? Probably not. I don't know. What the heck? That wasn't even that bad of a landing. Oh my goodness, my fans are all crooked. Some serious air, guys. Oh, zap strap's broken. Oh my lordy. What have I done? But yeah, guys, anyways, I'll uh, do a full detail um, of this truck when I get back home. I'm going to go grab the fire team. So yeah, if you enjoy the video, please like and subscribe. If there's no fire team, then it's a good 10 minute video, but uh, not the greatest video. Going to have a lot more jumps, but uh, anyways, guys, peace. Okay, guys, we're back up at the house. So... Tracks a sledge, M2C chassis, <clears throat> M2C drive shafts, M2C motor mount, M2C hex extensions, backflip 6S, uh, Arma D boots, backflips, uh, VG racing springs, uh, stock weight, trio aluminum chassis braces and bulkheads, M2C uh, ABCD blocks, run the Max 6. Hobbywing Max 6 ESC with the 1650, and I'm geared 2050. Um, I was geared 2046, but it was a bit too fast. Um, what else am I missing? I think that's pretty much about it. Trio caster blocks. Um, oh yeah, Basher Queen carbon fiber shock towers. Aluminum shock caps on the front, Traxxas, um, just the... Uh, the Traxxas ones, and then I'm running the Emulsion uh, Hot Racing ones on the rear. I'm getting the Emulsion for the front soon. Other than that, stock servo, and uh, pretty much stock everything else. Well, nothing really, but the rear arms are still stock. This one I keep kept broken until I put these M2C captured hinge pin things in, because I blew a, kept blowing a, it turned into an oval. So these really help if you're having a problem with your hinge pin always breaking or popping out. This really sucks them in there. Same with these aluminum diff cases. It really gets the bolts in and they, they won't strip out or come out. So it really locks everything in there. So I definitely recommend that. And uh, obviously it's a, it's a hot racing 50 spur and a 20 tooth techno pinion. But yeah, guys, cut short. I uh, broke a battery, two battery straps. So that kind of sucks. Um, but yeah, I'm going to uh, fix that. And then I'm going to take out the Almighty Fire Team next. So stay tuned, guys.